Hi, hello, 7JJ Heaven, welcome. Uh, today I'm going to show you some uh, Delphonics pouch where I keep uh, art supplies for evening <laughs> because every evening when I'm almost uh, in most cases in bed I have uh, two things before I go asleep. First one is my uh, kind of calendar, let's say journal, but without any uh, any bigger uh, goals. I just uh, do here some uh, doodles, uh, very random swatches and things like that. Uh, and every day I write what I did for my art today even if this is very very small thing I'm trying to to do every day anything for for my art um, remembering the the phrase that if you love something do it as often as you can so this this help uh, helps me to to keep this as a daily routine and by the way, this is the present from my uh, sister Natalie. She's not my real sister. Uh, she's my friend, but uh, we used to say that she's like a sister because very often we do the same things at the same time. And, and we even don't, don't know about this. Later on, it occurs that, that it was like that. And second thing, uh, what I do, this is a very fresh uh, uh, kind of habit. Uh, I do this um, five uh, year memory book. This is a very simple, fantastic uh, book for a whole year and for five years. So I imagine how interesting it will be to to be some here or here and seeing what I did the same day uh, one year ago, two years ago, three years ago. <laughs> it's just for fun. And it's really so small space that uh, writing is not painful. And at the same time, uh, there is always a few seconds to, to, to drop, uh, to draw a line. So this is it and uh, together with this uh, two I have always uh, this uh, uh, Delphonics pouch with me. I uh, choose some elements here specially for, this, uh, for these two uh, notebooks. Uh, first of all for this one art notebook when I uh, also, I, I write here some uh, social media and some uh, some doodles because they are not even sketches, but rather doodles. Then I keep uh, here different kind of uh, color pencils. These uh, are water soluble. These are neo color one. And these are my favorite Pablo. These two are quite new one. I've bought them from the second hand for really, I would say, even uh, crazy low uh, money. So that was that was great uh, deal for me. And uh, this one is uh, the set uh, from which my love to Pablo started. <laughs> Today uh, I have the, the, the big set, but this one is really fantastic uh, set to, to draw with some, uh, some of the blues is additional uh, because I received, I guess this one as, um, mm, as a free sample. Uh, to that and we have also here the extender of 
Karan Dash. I like it very much because it's very, very useful. There is no any additional elements here, so it's really very comfortable to, to keep it. Okie dokie. And here I have some favorite colors uh, from Graphic Tint, uh, Derwent. These are uh, colored uh, graphite pencils. Very interesting product, very, very nice. I like them a lot. So I keep it uh, in additional uh, pouch for not to uh, for not to destroy the points. What else? You know, some washi, some scissors, uh, some towels, the uh, Palomino pencil, very nice one. I love especially their uh, rubbers. They are so useful. It's really great. And... Uh, so I usually keep this one here because it's ideal, ideal space here and these two here. Um, there is a glue and uh, here uh, in this uh, uh, memory book I write usually with uh, fountain pen. This one is uh, very thin uh, uh, with nib F and uh, in the second I write with this gel pens. One Moji one is uh, Uniball. I also have uh, uh, this one <coughs> water brush if I want to water some color pencils or use even some <laughs> sommelier palette very small one very useful always here some clips uh, some highlighters uh, gold and silver pen and the uh, here are this kind of uh, pentel pen. It's also good for writing, for sketching. Also some pit artist, uh, a pit calligraphy pen. It's uh, calligraphy nib. But of course I use it for everything. And fine liners, which are also useful. Of course it's much more here than I really need at the evening. I usually uh, use these three packs of uh, of color pencils the most, and this from here the most. From here, from time to time. So, and uh, some note for for very quick notes if I need. And this is uh, this is very beautiful um, bookmark, magnetic bookmark from one of my uh, trips. I love this bookmark very very much. Okie dokie. Oh, and this one is also from the from the trip for uh, Asian Pacific uh, Museum. I like to, to keep with my Delphonics pouches mainly things which I receive or I buy with occasion being somewhere like this one or this one I received from my friend. And this one's uh, I've bought, but I would rather to have here things which I receive from somebody uh, because this is then always so so nice so guys it looks like that it helps me in the evenings it's very nice moment at the end of the evening to come down 
to think about nice things, always try to start uh, asleep with nice things in your head because otherwise it's it's not healthy. So this is this is my way to do it. <laughs> and uh, I do it really every day. Sometimes very rarely happens that uh, I don't. So then I do it in the morning for the last day. But in most cases, I uh, do it really every evening. I love this routine. It's very, very nice to me. And uh, it, uh, it means that the day is ending and I can take a rest. And before going to sleep, I can think about this, what I like the most. <laughs> So this is this is really great, great idea and great habit I just created for myself. Maybe you also have this kind of art, nice habit you created for yourself before you go to sleep. Just let me know if uh, I am very interested in it. And uh, I think other viewers will also appreciate to see how how you spend your uh, art moments at the evening. Thank you very much. Have a nice time. Bye bye.